Yo, what is good, YouTube, and welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Pink Diamond, Dr. J, Julia Serving, who looks like a top three shooting guard in the game, 100%. I think it's Kobe, Scotty, Dr. J, probably in that order would be my guess. But we're going to give Dr. J a chance to at least overtake Scotty in those rankings, and I do think he's going to be a really good card. I'm excited to try this card out. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 18,000 subscriber mark on the channel I upload every single day, and I would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. Dr. J is six foot seven at the shooting guard position, 98 offense, 99 defense. I will say one other thing real quick, by the way. A massive shout out to my boy Zach for letting me hop on his account to record this gameplay. Really do appreciate that a lot. Now, Dr. J, six seven at shooting guard, 98 offense, 99 defense with a 98 driving layup, 95 mid-range, 89 three ball, 98 driving dunk, 85 standing dunk, 84 free throw, 90 ball handle, 85 block, 8, 92 steal, 94 perimeter, 86 interior, 96 speed, 92 speed with ball, 96 excel, 94 lateral quickness, 93 strength, 98 vert. I mean, his stats are pretty ridiculous. I'm not gonna lie he is so souped right now 18 hops 43 golds four silvers he's got like 65 total badges or something like that pretty ridiculous he's got hoff acrobat fast twitch posterizer catch and shoot dead eye handles for days clamps off ball pass pogo stick bunny precision dunker two-step whistle and blow by also has gold Agent three blinders, claymore corner specialist, green machine, guard up, slippery off ball, bailout, unpluckable, ankle braces, challenger, glove, interceptor, rebound chaser, uh, free points, big driver, speed booster, triple strike, right stick gripper, fast feet, 94 feet, silver drop stepper, back down punisher as well. Really, he's not missing very many important badges but he does not have limitless range does not have anchor does not have brick wall does not have a movable enforcer that is i do believe a, a decently chunk a decent chunk of flaws so he is certainly not the perfect card by any means with no limitless no anchor no brick wall still should be a really solid defender he's six foot seven and honestly movement wise he actually moves quite well like i really do like his movement a lot i think he's gonna i think he's gonna move really well in my team um and i'm i mean i'm, I'm excited to try the card out man because like, his movement is, is not bad at all like I think it's really, really nice. I like his size up a lot. His same side burst is also quite good. Um, and his between the legs burst isn't bad either. His release is incredibly quick, smooth, easy to green. Fast, one of the faster, smoother releases in the entire game, even on normal time. And that John Wall base is just insanely quick. And it's just such a smooth, easy release to green. One of the fastest in the game as well. So that's another huge thing. So obviously he's super athletic, but the fact that he dribbles as well as he does and has as quick of a release as he does really is one of the things that elevates this card and is going to make him as good as he is. Now, attacking the Ram obviously should be exceptional. Stick dunking will be an, um, unbelievable with him. And then defensively he is also very good although the lack of anchor and brick wall means you're probably going to want him on one of the smaller players on the court if at all possible one of the less athletic less slashing players whatever the case may be so i think dr j will be a monster I'm really excited to try the card out let's hop into a game let's see what he can do all right respirative is who we're playing and he has steph kobe uh, Latrell Spruill, Shaq, and Joel Embiid. Not a terrible squad. Shaq at the center position is a little bit of a weak spot, but I'm not a big paint sitter. I like to uh, play people with mortals. And so I'm not just going to sit up my center and paint set off Shaq the whole game. Um, regardless, let's see what this Dr. J card can do, man. I'm excited to try him out. He's going to be really, really good, I do believe, at the... Uh, oh, I'm like off the wrong guy. Hold on. I'm like... I didn't even know where I was defensively there. We're in front. We're all right. Just wall up uh, Latrell. That should be a stop. Beautiful. Now stay in front of Shaq. He's probably going to try to drop step here. I'm kind of okay with that, though. Uh, oh, well, Shaq's open. Okay, hold on. We're good. 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 Get the board. Get the board. Let's go, Cap. Beautiful stuff. Throw it up to Dr. J. Get into a freelance. Let's space the floor and let's get attacking. Go downhill. Attack downhill. There we go. Hit our pop. We're not really a pop, but. And he fouls me. All right. That's fine. Just want to make sure we get spacing. If we can get him into a screen, start getting our offense going. Uh, probably should use Cat as a screen. So I have an actual half brick wall as my screener here and let's see if we can get downhill We're gonna go pick and pop and we're gonna see if we can get dr. J going towards the rim That is probably how you want to start off with him as a score I mean, obviously i'm not saying his that he's that he's not good at doing other things But as a slasher, that's where he's probably at his best and there we go Feeding kd for an open mid-range gets us an assist first possession going downhill If you can beat your first defender off the dribble get past him run your pick and roll that type of stuff You should be in a pretty good spot in most possessions honestly with Dr. J, uh, and very good stuff there by Wimby. Defensively, we get another stop, and we are chilling so far. Uh, his ability to get downhill is probably going to be one of his biggest attributes. Um, is I mean, it probably might be his biggest attribute, to be completely honest. Um, back it up again, though. I didn't really use that screen all that well, to be completely honest. Uh, and I'm not getting a blow by either. That's honestly pretty good defense. I will be. I will give him credit, but um, he's gonna have to defend one more time. And it's the same side burst. That's getting downhill. That's Dr. J, and that's a standing dunk. Yep. Beautiful. Good luck. He's 
He's something different as a slasher, man. You might stop him once, but I don't know if you're going to stop him again. We're going to see. I'm going to keep trying different stuff. We're going to keep doing, doing it. Beautiful. Terrible shot. We got our board, and now he's getting flustered. Dr. J is one of those cards that I just feel like I am very comfortable using at, at a competitive level because I know how to run offense with a card like Dr. J. Attack downhill again. Get to the rim, and Dr. J draws a foul that time. I honestly could have stick dunked that and probably gotten a dunk. But uh, it's regardless, just fine going to the free throw line with free points and a super good free throw release. You're looking at um, pretty easy free throws. So shouldn't be too hard at all to be consistent from the free throw line with Dr. J. He's got four points and one assist so far. And I like what I'm seeing so far, man. He feels like a card who you can run stuff through. Not Maybe not a true primary primary, but like... Uh, pretty close anyway i'll say that at the very least he's he's close to a primary good defense by kd getting around those screens really effectively now get back here i'm in thompson move laterally and that's good d step up on him x switch here y'all are not playing that how i wanted y'all to but that's fine good d when we play that and get ourselves a steal we're not paint sitting over here we're gonna go play that lane let's go burst here chill kobe's just off balling now of course he is regardless stop oh i wanted to shoot it so bad but it's not there didn't get off the screen all that well maybe i'll get off this next screen better um we do oh my god Dude, you are freaking... <sighs> I complain about off-ball for a reason. It's it's just... Ugh, it's gross. Like, there's only a few ways I can really consistently score on it, unfortunately. And right now, um, with how well Kobe's getting through the screen, I'm apparently just not scoring on it, period. Throw the back door, back up top here. We got 10 seconds left. See if we can attack off the screen here. Pop for me. Good push pop. That's beautiful offense. And I freaking missed it. But look at Dr. J fighting for me. How many wings are fighting on the offensive glass like that? I don't know many, but uh, Dr. J is. We love to see it. Attack downhill, Dr. J. Let's go, man. That offensive rebound was clutch, and it allows us to reset our offense. Get downhill. Dr. J making plays. We love to see it, man. This is an elite card. This is the best card from today's drop. Uh, well, speaking of the best card from today's drop, it's this card, Naman Thompson. He's right there. Y'all know my I got Amon Thompson come, gameplay coming very soon because he's a dog. I'm just letting y'all know. Um, regardless, Dr. J is going to be really, really good. and He's playing really well right now. I feel like he's impacting the game defensively. He's making some other stuff happen offensively. I'm liking what I'm seeing across the board. The movement isn't bad. That's a good step back fade. Nice shot there. Very nice step back jump shot. And he hits it. But 8-2 to two lead is not bad at all. Bursting up the court. Ooh, okay. I was going to try to go right. That's cool. Uh, actually, that's last two minutes. That's free points. We'll take that. Beautiful stuff. I didn't realize I was going to be fouled off of that. But I will take it slightly early. But he does knock it down. Second free throw is also up. Up and in no free points anymore because we're actually up by eight we're not in clutch situation anymore but still very very good performance so far bad pass cat makes a play oh my gosh my team is hooping right now my team is absolutely hooping oh my goodness direct oh I, I literally had the crab too i will say dr j is a legitimately good shooter like he has every single shooting badge except limitless it's just damn what like the off ball defense you can't beat it off the dribble for anything open like ever it's ridiculous terrible defense you are you are not good bro i'm not gonna lie bad bad offense it's all fine though catch uh you, the fact that i literally can't beat the beat the defender off the dribble like i can't stop and pop the, they will get there for a contest every single time and that is ridiculous to me i mean it is stupid that I have to slash off of a screen, otherwise I'm not getting downhill. This card's finishing is elite, though, and yes, he has a very good jump shot. Even if we haven't been able to showcase it in this game very much, he has a very good jumper that you will be able to take advantage of at times as well. Regardless, he's absolutely dominating. I think he's an absolute beast. Um, I'm not sure how much more gameplay we have to play. I I'm going to try because I just got takeover. I'm going to try to get a little more gameplay if this dude will actually play the game, but I think he's stalling me. No, well, I don't know. We got slashing take on Dr. J. I don't think you can change that although if you could i would like to um we'll see if i can if this dude will actually play defense i hope he does well i don't think he is so i guess we're gonna go get our go get ourselves a contact dunk and then we're in the in the game burst here attack downhill and we got the dunk meter going and we're gonna get to the rim and he gets a terribly small i know it's slashing take but like uh, with slashing take i feel like i should be getting whatever stop pop dr j i missed it bro this is stupid i'm killing this gameplay at the end making it look bad you know what I don't care. This game is over regardless. I think Dr. J's a monster. The couple of bad possessions isn't going to change that. Um, and hey, there you go. You scored a three ball. I'm proud of you. Very good. You're, you're tough. Good job. Um, is he playing? No, he's not playing. Go to the rim. Just go freaking stick dunk something, Dr. J. There we go. We can end with that. Look, look how big that meter was. That was almost impossible not to green. And he finishes with... 10, 13 points, one rebound, one assist, four seven from the field. Unfortunately, unable to... Um, hit the three ball but outside of that i think dr j i mean he is a great shooter he is y'all will find y'all will like the card as a shooter i just didn't shoot the ball well but i think he's an elite card and i do believe he is a top 
two or three small, probably three, top three small forward in the game, or shooting guard in the game, I should say. I think Pippen is still probably better, but I'm also running Pippen at small forward right now. I might pick this Dr. J up card up. He is one of two cards from today's drop that I'm considering adding, and the other one is Amon Thompson, who I'll have gameplay coming with in just a little bit. Regardless, I hope you all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon, and I appreciate y'all. Peace.